Hey, greetings from Texas. Today, we're going to take a look at the Atlas 10-inch limb saw. It's got a 9-foot reach. It's uh, 40 volt. I have two uh, other Atlas products from Harbor Freight, uh, the 40 volt wheat trimmer and the 80 volt wheat trimmer, and we're, we are real happy with them. So with the 40 volt, you can use the 80 volt battery for uh, twice, twice the runtime. Um, gasoline engines these days with ethanol, unless you're buying uh, ethanol free, um, you know, you're gonna have trouble, uh, you're gonna have to do a lot more maintenance. And sometimes all I need instead of firing up a gas engine is something quick. Anyway, I thought we'd uh, try it. We're gonna unbox it and uh, I'll demonstrate it and see how it works. So stay tuned. Okay, we have it unboxed, so let's take a look what we got. Um, we have instructions, which if you're a man, you don't need. You don't need to read instructions, right? Um, here's the actual first length. Um, this is expandable to nine feet, which will be nice. And um, we have a bottle of chain lube. Usually if you take off the blade, generally, if you want to know how tight to uh, tension it with the supply wrench, normally they come from the factory at the right tension. So just kind of take note how that feels. And then we have our pull sections and of course our batteries. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this together. So this has an arrow here and there's an arrow on this yellow thing. Simple enough. And repeat, repeat the process with this piece. And I'm going to start off with this uh, 40 volt, and that'll give me an idea today what the runtime is. So let's fill it up with oil and then we'll take her out for a spin. All right, we fill the uh, oil reservoir. It took that whole bottle. I don't usually keep manuals and uh, instructions anymore because they're always available on the website and I get tired of uh, having a file drawer cabinet full of paperwork. So let's go out and cut a limb. Okay. It's a giant cottonwood tree, but you can see these branches are now hanging down over the road and um, hitting them with my vehicle. So I'm going to cut, uh, start off cutting this branch here. Remember, gravity uh, is your friend, but it could be your enemy. So um, we're, I'm going to want to cut that limb from the side or the top because as gravity pulls it down, if you cut it from the bottom, it's gonna pinch the blade and uh, that could pull your chain off the guide. So um, eventually this tree's gonna come down, but I'm gonna part it out now, take some of that weight off and um, some of these branches just might break um, because this tree's uh, pretty much dead. Okay, and, and if you don't need the full length of the saw, you can just take out this middle section. And I'm just gonna let the weight of the blade do the work. All right, that worked pretty good. And you have this hook too, which you can use uh, to pull things down. So let's go up a little Higher here. I don't know if you can see that one.
Let's try this dude here. Hopefully it won't hit the camera. That was a little taller. I'm going to have to get on my trailer. Okay. Well, that's the Atlas. 10 inch, nine foot long, 40 volt chainsaw, limb cutter. All right, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching.